Martine, hey, look. What have you done? What have you done? Where is she? She's safe. Look, I'm gonna find a way to make this right with you. That will take some doing. Thing. Hell, it was just down the freeway. Trevor about? He's probably out somewhere drinking human blood or eating household pets. <laughs> He's not that bad. Really? Well, okay, he is pretty bad. But he's got a sensitive side. Oh, yes, he's very sensitive. When he gets his feelings hurt, he's devastated. So what's your story? I ain't got a story. I'm an independent thinker. Living out here, away from the man. From what I can tell, you're like a high school athlete. Living off old glories. You used to be able to manage heat. And now, you're worried if your loafers are getting scuffed. Any more bullshit comes out of your mouth, you're gonna learn all about my past glories firsthand. You understand? <laughs> Absolutely, sir. That came out wrong, all wrong. 
Tell Trevor the monthly train is coming through. What monthly train? The monthly train. Where have you two been? Getting some fresh air. Talking of beautiful things. Yes, I hear Stockholm Syndrome is very nice this time of year. Hey, watch your mouth, boy, all right? It's always been a dream of ours. The train of dreams. The hell are you talking about? I'm talking about gold. Enough to keep Ron in trailers and you in therapy. Enough so that we can pay off that Mexican and get you back in town, baby! Yeah! <laughs> this better be fucking good! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! Fuck. Ah! Oh, man, we've talked about this hygiene thing before, bro. I invite you into my home, this is how you repay me? It's like living with a fucking horny skunk. Get a boat and meet me under Rat and Canyon Bridge. I'll be on the earpiece. All right, so I'm taking a car to steal a boat, stick up a train, and get some gold. That's about the size of it. Make it a fast boat. Ah, the logistical mind of Trevor Phillips. So, it's like gold bricks on board, right? Sometimes. This is a high-value courier service run by... <laughs> Merriweather. Oh, Merriweather? Tranquilo, Mike. This ain't a weapons train. It's goods too valuable to insure for air travel train. Gold. Sometimes gold. Sometimes our work. Priceless antiquities. Sometimes enough for you, me, Ron, everyone. Fine. And here she is, the magical train. Don't leave without me! Mike, oh yeah, another thing for your shopping list. We'll need some bombs. Okay. I'll pick him up when I'm back at the trailer. Back at the trailer? Where are you? We got work to do. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's why I'm getting changed. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. getting changed? What if, what have you turned into? Stop that train! All aboard! I'm gonna take it! Hold up! There's a new conductor on this train. You on the water? Sure, just caught a fish. Let me know when you need me. Got it? Eat it? Be under that fucking bridge. When we go past Polito Station, whole of Merriweather's gonna be on to us. We've been rerouted! Sorry! Em, Em, I ain't far out. You under the bridge?
doing? I'm living the life, my friend. This is quite a spot you pick. Enjoy it now, because it's about to start raining fire. <laughs> oh, shit! Shit! What would I blow up a train to steal? Don't be smart! Find the loot! Our moment of judgment is fast approaching! Scar's getting wet, Mikey! Open up that freight car! Container, come on! There's only so much this old heart can take! The container, Michael! here, bro! Stop looking for your tiddler and find the loot! Weather recovery teams arrive! You want to die in a government holding facility? Find something and go! I'm spending more time giving status reports than looking! I'm in a 
run out of bullets at this rate. Come on! I can tell you I'm looking, or I can actually look! Got something? Let's get the fuck out of here! Finally! Come on! Get in! Let's go! In the boat! Come on! If you please. We got both on us. Nature, you're right. It's a beautiful thing. There's nothing natural about this. Nada. Pump key, she's yours. The ground forces are on us. Life boat, please! We gotta deal with this boat! Hey, Pete! Check the coast! I forgot to say, nice outfit! And by nice, I mean lame! Cars, up there, Pete! Get them off of us! Drown, you shit! Chopper, right behind us! You feeling alive? Juice pumping through your glands? My glands are just fine. Without the crashing train, exploding helicopters, and sinking boats. Come on, we got a chopper on our ass! Somewhere we can pull up, just down the coast. Whoa! Man, you work hard for your living. Boil it down for me. How much you think you make for a senseless killing, huh? Couple nickels? Times are tough. Have been since we put you in the ground. Ron organized some transport for us. His and hers, huh? Because of your independent spirit. Hey, 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 hey! Hey, before you go, show me the loot. All right. It's perfect. Perfect for fucking what? For squaring things with that Mexican psycho. We give him this, and you end your relationship with that little lady. Maybe we won't be dead men in Los Santos. I don't fucking see that Silicon City again. It'll be too soon. But this is my job, not your call to make. Nah, nah, your job. Fuck things up with the Mexican to begin with. My job, my score, get your own. Wait, you give me that case, I'll give you something bigger. Oh. What? Union Depository. Fuck off. Can't be done. I never said impossible. Just very difficult. Verging suicidal? That a line you're afraid to cross? Come on, T. You remember the dreams? Couple kids pulling jobs, the big one. I know it sounded crazy back then, huh? But hey, you and me together again. With Lester and Franklin on board. We can do this thing, T. This ain't no dream no more. Yeah. You keep the case. Fuck me. Okay, hey! All right. Here. 
keep that silly fucking thing. And you can keep Patricia as well, all right? Because I respect that lady, and I ain't gonna hold her back. <sighs> Thank you. Just remember, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on you every inch of the way, all oh, right? Of course. And if that bastard fucking cheats on her one more time, mm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. You know, Trevor, we both know you're not the marrying kind. But hey, it's great to be back in business, huh? Let's bring it on. The big one! The big one! Hello. Townley's on the line, too. Hey, Trev. All right. I need your whole crew over at Cape Catfish. We're moving on the chemical weapons plant. Nah, 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 nah. I just gave something to Lester. I need to deal with some stuff. Get back to Los Santos. Just, uh, give me a week. We got the equipment with your Polito money. The gangbanger's already on the way. The window's open, my friend, and you are jumping out of it. Shit. Shit! Los Santos ain't going anywhere, bud.
I just need a ride. Hey, got room for one more? No, I think there's room for a little one. So, big favor. Can you take me to the top of Vinewood Hills by the sign? Thanks, this is so sweet of you. I was starting to think no one was going to stop. Short dress, boots, vulnerable but playful demeanor. What more does a girl have to do these days? You cast out this kind of bait, you'd expect at least a couple of old sharks to come sniffing. But along you came. Thank God. Uh, less of the old, please. I'm in the prime of my life. Just promise me you're not going to wear my skin or imprison me in a crawl space for 20 years? Joke. Kind of. You're cool, right? Sorry, I'm coming down. I've been parting like a biatch. Yesterday was a blizzard, man. I don't even remember getting out of bed, let alone going to bed. Good times. Okay. And what's on top of the Vinewood Hills? I'm going to see my man. He's a security guard at the broadcast tower right behind the famous Vinewood sign. He's been stressed out, really working long hours, so I thought I'd surprise the big lug. We haven't seen each other for like a week. Or maybe it's two. I don't know. Crazy how time flies. Wait, that's my phone. Speak of the devil. Hey, sweetie, I was just talking about you. To this guy who was nice enough to give me a ride? No, not like that. I'm pitching back into town. Yeah, I know what happened last time, but I'm pretty sure this guy is okay. I ran out of money or I would have gotten a cab. Yes, all the thousand you gave me. What's the big deal? I said I'd pay you back. I'm sorry, okay? My phone was out of juice. I only just got it charged. I was staying at a friend's at Sandy Shores. You know, Brianna or Susie. No, I haven't spoken to him in weeks. This is just some random guy, I swear. Calm down, babe. Look, would you tell him? Are you talking to me? Yes, tell him you're not a guy called Brian. You're just some random guy. What? Just shout it. I'm just some random guy not called Brian. There, babe, you believe me now? Babe, babe! Shit, he hung up on me. Sorry about that. So, on a scale of 1 to 10, how well do you think that went? He'll be fine when I surprise him. Probably just having a bad day. He can never stay mad at me for long. Opposites attract, you know. Fuck! Detract, you know. He's the serious, responsible, pay your bills, save for the future type, and I'm the sexy, bohemian, go off for days and do X in the middle of the desert type. I'm young. I'm still exploring my mind. Discovering who I am. He knows I'll come back. When you run out of money. Whoa there, random guy. Less of the judging. Less of the judging. Wait, there's you my don't phone see again. This car here. What's up? Yeah, hitching back into town. How do you think I feel? I'm wrecked. I know, I'll have one last bag etched on my tombstone. Don't flatter yourself. I can walk just fine, thank you. You're bad. Anyway, gotta go. I'll text you later. Don't tell me. Brian? What? No, just one of my girlfriends. Look, I'm seriously flagging now. I'm going to rest my eyes for a few minutes if that's cool. See if I can power nap my way into a second wind. So, broadcast tower behind the Vinewood sign. I think it's Mount Han Drive. Oh my god!
a possession. Let it go. Now! Ugh. Smells like shit coming out of your mouth. Damn! You asked for it. Shit. Move! Ah! with you. Going on, ladies. Hello, Trevor. What kept you? Business, Michael. Business. Uh. All right. I'm the CEO of a big international corporation. It's very time-consuming. Nothing, of course, you'd understand, being a gentleman of leisure. Uh -huh. You know. You know. Frankly, <laughs> if there's one thing that you're gonna learn from being around us, please just... fucking insanity. Then they can't fry you. If you want something done, go to the busy man. This rich fuck. Is useless. Oh, oh, ho, hold on, man. Could y'all knock this shit off? Oh, look! Boys, your boys, it's the feds. Hey, 
Where's the other three? What other three? We told you to bring along six. This is a six-man job. No, you didn't. You Dave did? No, Dave didn't. You said you'd do it. That is a frickin' lie! I do not get things wrong. All right, great. Then we're out of here. Uh, 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 fuck uh, 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 it. Let's go. You three can do it alone. And I fuck you. You do your own dirty work. Hey, I do my dirty work every day, keeping the country safe from scum like you. And you're doing a great job, sir. Hey, you want this job done? Then come with us, huh? Come on! Come on, mister! Leisure wear, Mr. Depressed Accountant. Let's go save America! Who the fuck are we saving it from this time? This is the real deal. My sources are convinced there's a plot in international affairs, you know, the agency, and they're using this facility to make a serious nerve toxin. Ah, <laughs> bullshit. Yeah, which they plan in their mind-blowing insanity to let a major terrorist release on a metropolitan area so they can continue to get funding. Nothing increases funding for fighting terrorism more than successful acts of terrorism. <laughs> so, so, all right, so let me get this straight then. No, 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 You're... no, 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 there is no getting it straight, that's the point. Now we're doing this! You two are on getaway. Fuck off and make it happen. Michael, you're with us! What size flipper you wear? Agent Norton, been a while since you were in the field. The sight of you in neoprene is something we save for our worst enemies. Shut up, I'll be fine. And you, get in. You're driving. Go down the coast. The facility's a few clicks south of us. Listen to me, Steve. No wisecracks, got it? No fucking cliches. We're fighting for the freedom of the people today. Don't lecture me on patriotism. You've been living outside the system too long. Social responsibilities, a joke to you. So maybe I redeem myself, get killed in the process, huh? That old bullshit. No one is dying on my watch. Not even the burnout bank robber with temper issues and nothing to live for. This is the bay. We can get in through the discharge tunnel. Here it goes!
do it. All right, we go down the vent, find the access point. You sure this thing comes out where you think it does? The intel is good. We're a hundred yards out. Ah, I feel like I'm giving a colonoscopy to the Statue of Happiness. Nice change from being up Trevor Phillips' ass all day. You feel that? Water's getting warmer. You wet your pants, Davy? This is a cooling tunnel. Of course it's getting warmer. No one urinated. Uh, I know for a fact that that ain't true. The problem with this job is I only get to know the criminals who are dumb enough to get themselves caught. Yeah, only I wasn't caught, remember? I turned myself in. He makes a point. That makes you doubly dumb. This is the third turbine. That's an air pocket. Take it up to the surface, people. Come on, get up the ladder. I was born ready. Let's do this. Come on, Dave. What's the plan? Hey, hey, hey. We locate the toxin and action our escape strategy. That's what we got. Great. Lead the way. Bank robber, set your phaser to stun. Dave, you're on point. I'm leading from the rear. Against the wall, quick. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Defibrillate our friend here, Michael. Can we go? Hands where I can see him. Drop your piece. Okay. Now hit the elevator. So what exactly does a neurotoxin look like? You're on a need-to-know basis, bank robber. Shut it. Elevator coming. Body on board. Stay vigilant. Out, out, out! He's... Get the pass! All right, we go! How you feeling about this? I feel pretty damn fine. Yeah, if only your camera crew was here. Round to the right, come on. Clear, let's go. You see the lab geeks? I don't want trouble from these two. Put him up! Put him up! Ah! Please! Please, please! They're down. Let's go. Corridor goes around to the left. Don't sit there. Bring it to them. Behind the wall. Security detail about to make a pass. judgment call I dare you just a little pinprick what can a pinprick do ask the monkey go on a tiny amount on your hand clear we move forward use the card on that swiper There's a lab rat in with the toxin. Let's do this. Gore, now! I don't know what you think you're doing! 
The locking mechanism is triggered from the inside. What's that? I got this. You! Hands up! Back up! We dropped your buddy. Now open the door before we blow it and drop you. Stick up, guy. You're expendable. Get the nerve agent. This will make me the most dangerous man in the country. I'm also the most shit scared. Oh, man. Thank you, federal government. The toxin is volatile. We need to get it into a refrigeration unit. Facility security has been compromised. Warning, warning. Ah, let's finish this. You got the right weapon? This shit's about to get real. Sec detail, fair. You're a clown. My buddy's been shot. Help. Hey, you work for the wrong branch of the government. Asshole. You hit me in the wrong place and we're this all idiot. Uh. Fucking slippery bullet. Shit, take him down. Uh. Don't go uh. behind the mission. into a refrigeration unit. Warning. Facility has been breached. Facility has been breached. It's gonna get heavy here. He's a real gun. Agency security. Reloading. Drop it. Hey, you work for the wrong branch of the gun. Kill you! Hold by the door! Can we 
We can't slow down! Don't fuck with me! in my pocket. There you go. Phillips is on his way. Good. Get this thing ready to move. I'm just a couple clicks out. Is the package ready? Package is ready. Get over here, man. I can't believe they spent the tank from the Polito job on this chopper. It's a flying pig rig. And we need a flying pig rig right now. Mr. Phillips, can I 
trust you to dispose of the chopper? I got more important things to worry about messing around with this stupid chopper. Like things that actually mean something. Not made up wars, with made up enemies. Matters of the heart. Is he fucking with me? Probably not. Hey, Frank. It's cracking, man. So the chemical weapon in there, right? If it even is a chemical weapon, hell, it could be shaving cream for all I know. By the way, next time you're getting wet. Oh, but there won't be a next time, will there, Davey? There never is. I'll do my best for you. I always try. Yeah, well, maybe this time we'll get lucky. Maybe this time Steve will succumb to the strains of enhanced interrogation techniques. Interrogate him? Are you insane? They're probably decorating him right now. Hey, Davey, your boys at the agency are on to you, remember? Ah, huh? you and Stevie. Just try and keep your heads down. Yeah, putz. What's this? Oh, fucking A. Yes! What's up, man? My days in the wilderness are over. Lester, he settled up with that crazy Mexican motherfucker. Gave him the artifact. <laughs> now, as long as Trevor handles the wife, we're good. But what about him, man? Yeah, fuck him. He likes the desert. Besides, we do one big score, we're all gonna have to go our own separate ways anyway. Oh, man. I can't wait to get back to that movie studio. <laughs> yeah, well, all right, man. Well, shit, I'll holler at you later then, all right? What a shit show. I'll tell you what, you could take this desert and stick it. My life may be a world of pain, but from here on out, it's gonna be cool, comfortable, air-conditioned pain. <laughs> Take it easy. I had a wonderful time, Trevor. But we both know I made a vow to my husband. I know! You have a great pain inside you. But you are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy and so sad in my life. You have a beautiful way with words. <laughs> for, for, some, for some reason, everyone I love abandons me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. Street, you! I know. Stupid I know.
No. Stay. You better treat her right, man! I will, amigo! The other wise... The other ear! Of course! The way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Good friends. Such good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another. That's fucking perfect. Uh, thank Michael for this statue. It is exquisite. Yeah. Yeah, I will. <laughs> 